Now that we have a Bioconda package for our tool, it's time to create the wrapper for the tool within Galaxy. First, we're going to go to the Tools folder in Galaxy. Then, just purely for organizational purposes, we are going to create a directory called My Tools. Within that directory, we're going to create another directory for the tool itself. Now, tools that use the same underlying package can be housed within the same directory. However, as Polarifon is a standalone tool and not part of a suite, it will be the only tool within this directory. Now that we're in this directory, we will create the skeleton of the tool wrapper by running a command called Planemo tool net. This generates a very basic version of a Galaxy wrapper that needs to be filled out. However, it adds all of the default tags so that you can more easily write the tool. To do this, we're going to run Planemo tool init and then give it the parameters ID and name, both of which will be Bellerophon here. However, you can use different names for the two of them. While we are here, we might as well create all of the required files and directories for this tool. First, we are going to create a directory called test data. This is where all files used in the tests for the tool will be housed. We will also create another file which is .shed.yaml. This is where Galaxy finds metadata about the tool. Let's take a look at the structure of our tool directory. And then we can open up the tool skeleton itself and let's see what Planemo tool in it created.